All righty, I got some exciting news for you guys today. Um, I can confirm that the brake magnets have arrived on site. I am being told that those massive crates back there are the trains. Um, I personally don't see it. Uh, the crates are big enough to hold, like, they would be big enough if the train's off the chassis. I'm saying the word wrong, chassis. Um, but outside of that, I just, I, I think it's just station, electrical bolts, and all that in those crates. I remember Yukon Striker having the same crates with the bolts and the electrical and all that in them. But I wouldn't be surprised if, uh, my birdies are right and those are the trains and the chassis. Um, so, uh, we'll take that with a grain of salt right now. I can't confirm that. Uh, here's Tundra Twister's plot of land. <laughs> it is flooded. The rebar cage is in the ground. I do think they still have to pour some cement. Um, it's hard to tell when you're this far away and, uh, don't have the right angle. Um, so I don't have any information on, uh, if the cement has been poured for Tundra Twister yet. But the re the rebar is in the ground. So that's super exciting. Um, the Snoopy's Racing Whale Railway. So electrical work on the station area has started. If you look really closely, when I zoom in even more, I think you'll be able to see it. Or if you look really closely just down there, um, you can see uh, some electrical piping and all that in the station area. Um, due to Wonderland's blog, we know that it'll have a lowering and raising platform, similar to Yukon Strikers platforms, but just on the side. Um, thank you to Discord, the people in there explaining that in detail for me. Um, and yeah, so it's, uh, it's coming along. <laughs> uh, they are making good progress. I have heard the warmer weather actually is starting to negatively impact the construction site. As we just saw with Tundra Twister, um, it's muddy, uh, which is hard to work construction in. We are obviously going to be keeping an eye on Whitewater Canyon as this is a very plausible construction area for the 2025 edition and possible 2024 additions. So we'll be keeping an eye on this location. Um, it is definitely uh, one of the bigger areas in terms of uh, growth, in terms of Frontier Canada. So uh, definitely watch out for Whitewater Canyon and Action Theater. And obviously, there's one more area we can't forget about. We gotta keep an eye on the mountain area um, as a trailer is there and some small infrastructure work has started in that area all right as always guys thanks so much for watching these construction updates uh hopefully you enjoyed this week's podcast and yeah have a great one guys bye